happy holidays. I am back with the second installment of my 2015 holiday gift guide. Last week I shared the little luxuries category which ranges from about $20 to about $50. And this week I'm going to go extravagant splurges which is $50 bucks and up. Um, and just like with the little luxuries guide, I have broken down the gifts that I have picked this year into gender categories. So I'm going to start for her, show you some things for him, and then I have some gender neutral things that might be nice to give to a family or a couple or something like that or just anybody. I think they're nice in general. So I'm going to go in order of price, more or less, um, starting, like I said, with gifts for her. Um, there are just so many wonderful sets out this year, and something that really caught my eye that I know I would like to find under the tree is the Laura Mercier Body and Bath La Petite Souffle Cream, body cream collection. This is really, really cool. It's a set of six little glass pots of the Laura Mercier body cream, which is very, very popular. I've never actually tried it because I never know which scent to pick up, and it's kind of a luxury item. I think this is really nice for bath and body product kind of gal who wants to try out the range. It has, um, let's see, almond coconut milk, ombre vanilla, um, pistachio, fresh fig, creme brulee, and uh, tarte au citron, so something kind of citrusy. Um, really, really nice. Retails for $60. You get a ton of product, and I just think this is a really nice, really nice, luxurious treat. Next on my list for her is a cute pair of cozy pajamas. You really, I love giving sleepwear for the holidays. I've said this in my last video too. These are really nice. I had never heard of this brand before, but I saw this when I was walking through Nordstrom the other day. PJ Salvage makes these really cute printed flannel pajamas and they are so soft and cozy. Sometimes when you buy a flannel pajama, they don't feel very substantial. They feel a little flimsy. They don't even feel soft until you've washed them like three dozen times. These feel nice and substantial and soft right off the bat. I really like this print. It's got little s'mores on it. Um, they have uh, lots of other prints available, so something to suit everybody's style, and I just think it's a nice cozy gift. These retail for $62. Fragrance is something that's really nice to give during the holidays, but I always hesitate because it's hard to know what other people's like unless you know exactly what exact fragrance. They, I mean, you know, fragrance is so personal. So when I saw this set by um, Jo Malone, which is one of my favorite, favorite perfume brands, um, I just thought, that's it. That's the perfect gift to give to somebody who's into fragrance or who wants to start out with fragrance or wants to start out with high-end fragrance, doesn't really know what they want or likes a variety of things. This is a really nice set. First of all, Jo Malone always puts things in such a nice presentation. The box is lovely. They wrap it with a bow for you. This is their limited edition, um, the Art of Fragrance Combining set. <laughs> um, so you can, um, you know, the, the point is that it, it comes with five fragrances so you can kind of mix and match, wear them individually or together, however you want. But first of all, let's just look at the inside of the box. Like, is this not stunning? It's actually got this raised velvet part and this floral design. I just think it's really beautiful. And it comes with five of their best-selling fragrances in their cologne. So uh, it's a wood sage and sea salt, peony and blush suede, English pear and freesia, pomegranate noir, lime and basil, and mandarin. And these are really, really nice um, little bottles. They are uh, little spray bottles. So not only are they like the perfect little purse size, but this is actually quite a bit of perfume. I mean, it takes a long time to go through perfume because you don't need a ton of it. It's, if it's a nice perfume, and Jo Malone's very nice quality perfume, cologne, they call it cologne, is actually stronger than perfume. Uh, but it's not just for men. It's just, it's just a terminology. I don't really know that much about it. Uh, but I just think this is so, so nice. $115. That might seem steep, but considering how much fragrance you get, it's actually a really good deal. And it's just an absolutely stunning gift. Speaking of stunning gifts, I really don't know how you can go wrong with a little blue box under your tree. Now when you see this and you think dollar signs, like that is going to be really, really expensive whatever's in there. Not necessarily. Tiffany does have some really nice, beautiful silver jewelry at like, you know, affordable in the extravagant splurges category prices. Um, and I'm going to show you this, but I just like, 
Can't, what girl doesn't get excited when she sees this under the tree? I personally don't know anybody who wouldn't get excited. My husband's so cute actually. So Tiffany always does a nice presentation right with their boxes and bows too. Doesn't really need any further wrapping. But whenever my husband gives me a Tiffany gift, he always wraps it so I can't, so I don't know what it is until I unwrap it. And he actually wraps it with the, like, with the bow on under the wrapping. He's so cute. So I picked two of my own personal favorite pieces this year. Um, that I've had for years and loved and worn. These are new that I'm showing you today because I might have a cheeky little giveaway at the end of this, stay tuned. But uh, these are really, really beautiful. So I have the little, I'm gonna do close-ups, it's gonna be a little bit hard to, for you guys to see. I have the little silver bow earrings, which are absolutely darling. They are gorgeous pieces for every day or for glamming up a bit, especially for the girl who maybe like me likes kind of more dainty jewelry. Really, really beautiful. Tiffany jewelry is beautifully made and it keeps beautifully, like, you know, you have to polish it every once in a while, but it just is gorgeous. Um, alternatively, you could do the little mini bow necklace. Again, another simply stunning piece. If you wanted to go all out and give both, it'd be a gorgeous set. This bow necklace actually comes in other sizes as well. The one I have is slightly bigger, but I really like the mini. I think it's beautiful. And both of these jewelry pieces retail for $175. So it's really quality jewelry gift, really thoughtful. The bow is kind of appropriate for the holidays anyway, I think, um, for under $200. And it's Tiffany. So. I really don't think you can go wrong. That's my personal opinion, but there it is. And then my last gift pick for her in the extravagant splurges category this year is the Clarisonic. I have used and loved my Clarisonic for almost five years now, and I absolutely adore it. I use it every day. I have given this as gifts before to people in my family who have really enjoyed it. It comes in different models and different price ranges. This one is the Mia 3, which is most comparable to the one I use now, which I don't think they make anymore. I can't even remember what it's called. But it has three speeds. It's basically a facial sonic cleansing brush. And to me, it just really helps clean the skin in a gentle way. You can buy different brush heads for it to suit, you know, whatever your skin preference is. Um, and they have these really nice sets available now. This one is actually a $245 value for $199. Um, and it comes with some really nice quality skincare to go along with it, as well as the brush and the, the charging thing as, as well. Um, and I just think this is a nice splurgy item, something that somebody might really want, but might not purchase for themselves. Perfect, explurgy, explurgy, that's a word. I just made it up, but I, <laughs> it's a word now. Explurgy gift, um, and I think a lot of ladies, especially those who are really into skincare, would really enjoy something like that this year. Now I'm going to move on to my gift picks for him, starting with a mini drone. I actually asked my brother for help on this because I knew I wanted to include a fun tech present, like a tech toy for guys. Um, and my brother is very, very knowledgeable about drones and airplanes and remote controlled things. And he said this was one of the nicest kind of introductory level mini drones out there. It's about $70. You can get it on Amazon as well as from Horizon Hobby directly. Uh, and it's the Inductrix Beginner EDF Drone, which is self-leveling. Now, I don't know if you can tell from the picture, but it has these sort of protecting um, bumpers around the blades. It's super, super, super safe to use. My brother said he's let his daughters, my nieces who are 10 and 12, fly this without worry at all. Um, it is remote controlled. Um, it's just really a fantastic little drone. It says it right on the box. I think it's a really fun gift for the guy who likes to play. Kind of a more practical direction now are these really beautiful leather gloves that I found at J. Crew. They are absolutely stunningly gorgeous. Beautiful leather, cashmere lined, but guess what? They're tech friendly. They're touch screen capable. That was like the clincher for me. I've been wanting to find something like this for my husband for a long time. In fact, this is a gift that I've purchased for him and I am going to give him for Christmas this year. They are incredibly soft. $98, but really high quality leather, really nice um, 
cashmere interior and also the touchscreen capability. It's like I've never seen that before. I don't know if that's new this year with the leather glove. They don't even have um, special tips or anything. It's something built right into the fabric. It's called um, UR Conductive Technology. So I think that's really, really cool and just a really nice thoughtful gift for a fella in your life. I'm going to show you another one of the gifts that I actually bought for my husband this year, so shh, don't tell him. Um, <laughs> this is a Tommy Bahama, now hold on, I've got to read the name because it's long, Flip Side Twill Reversible Half Zip Sweatshirt. I have purchased these for the men in my life before. They are absolutely gorgeous. I love shopping Tommy Bahama for men's gifts when I'm doing, um, you know, clothing uh, because it's really nice quality, kind of casual, but nice looking men's wear. Uh, and I love that it's reversible. I love the two colors. Uh, and it's a really nice quality sweatshirt. It almost feels like a sweater and it looks like sweater quality on, like that kind of niceness, but it's casual. You can just throw it on or you can dress it up with a collared shirt underneath. Um, and what I love about Tommy Bahama is they also have their big and tall category on their website where some of their um, popular items they sell for men who are broader or longer. My husband is very, very long-waisted and barrel-chested, so um, I always try to find things that I know he'll be comfortable in, and I love that I can buy, buy that from Tommy Bahama. Um, so the, the regular men's, I think, on this retails for $98, and then the big and tall ones are a little bit more, about $118, um, because they're just, you know, they're more fabric, but really gorgeous, wonderful menswear, and very practical at the same time. The next item I have to show you, I can't actually hold up because it's actually quite heavy, so I'm just gonna insert a clip here showing you guys. It's a 500 piece Monte Carlo clay poker chips set. I asked my husband what his gift pick of the year would be if he was buying something for one of his buddies or one of the you know guys in his life, and he said a really nice poker set. If, if your man is into that, my man and his friends and family members are really into poker, so it, that's a kind, kind of gift that would get a lot of mileage in our family uh, and in our circle of friends. I asked him to pick one out. He found this on Amazon, a really great price considering the heft and weight of the chips. Um, it's uh, $99.95 and it is heavy. I mean, it is like, these are solid chips um, and they come with, you know, the different uh, denominations, has a couple of packs of cards, some dice, a dealer button, all in a nice aluminum carrying case, which is very standard for poker chip sets, uh, but a really nice quality gift and I think at a really great price. My last pick for men, and this won't be for every guy, but it might really suit your guy. Claire Sonic has released the new Alpha Fit Sonic Cleansing System for men. It's a Claire Sonic face brush for men. When I saw this at Sephora, I was like, yes, that is a good idea. Um, and it's, you know, it's got two settings. It's a little, it's designed a little differently. It's more kind of man friendly, I guess, a little less um, brush looking and a little more like shaving accessory looking. I think they tried to design it so men wouldn't feel like girly using it. Um, it retails up for $189. It comes with a charger, it comes with a brush head, and it comes with Clarisonic's Alpha Cleanser. Um, now, a really nice, like, super luxe gift would be to combine this with that Jack Black Power Pack set that I shared in my little luxuries guide. Um, so it's a skincare set with the brush. It might be, you know, that your guy is really into that. From the reviews that I read on this, the men who have been using it so far, it is a new product, like I said, really enjoy it and find that it makes shaving easier and makes their skin softer, um, which is kind of the whole point. Um, so I think this is a really nice gift, $189. Like I said, it's for a particular kind of guy. It's not for every guy. Like I'm not sure I could get my husband to use this, although I'm sure his skin would really benefit from it. But it's a really, really nice, thoughtful gift for the guy in your life who wants to take care of his skin and the Clarisonic doesn't have to be just for ladies. I know a lot of women whose husbands or significant others um, borrow their Clarisonic without, you know, really having permission. So if that's your guy, maybe drop a hint and get him one of his own. My last category of gift picks is gender neutral. And like I said, this might, these might be nice things for a family or a couple or just for some, you know, anybody in general who might like kind of more home goods sorts of things. Um, so my first pick are the Alessi Heart Spoons. I love these. I actually have 
12 of these myself because I use them every single day. They are absolutely stunning, beautiful design spoons. A really nice modern design, but also very whimsical and fun with the heart shape. Um, I'll show you in the close up what they look like. Uh, they are really, really nice spoon, I must say, and I just think this is a really beautiful gift. A nice housewarming gift. If you wanted to bring this for a party and you wanted to spend a little bit more, these retail for about $55 um, on Amazon, at last I checked. Um, you know, it's a little bit more of a splurgy housewarming gift, but I think a really nice one. Um, and, and just beautiful set. Something I've noticed recently is that Moscow Mules, this is a kind of drink, it's like ginger beer and vodka, I think, and mint, has made a huge comeback. The drink is enhanced by serving in a copper mug, and the copper mugs are everywhere right now, and I looked at dozens of different varieties of copper mugs for this guide, but I settled on these ones from Williams Sonoma because they were the nicest, in my opinion. They got really good reviews on use and care. Um, they're really beautiful copper. You have to polish them if you want to keep keep them looking golden shiny. Um, but these are a really good price. I think right now they're just about $24 each on Williams Sonoma. So if I was giving this as a splurgy gift, I'd probably give four of them as a set, or you could just give two if it's to a couple. Really nice item for a couple who likes you know, a special drink. You don't have to put just Moscow mules in there. You can put other things as well. Um, but it's just a really in thing right now. And also these are just a really nice gift. Um, I know that, um, we have a set of these, and, and my brother has a set of these, and they, we use them all the time for, for parties and things, so fun little, fun little thing for the, for, the, for the bar. Kind of keeping along the home goods line here, a really nice acrylic tray is a beautiful gift, but a really nice acrylic tray that is personalizable is even better. Erin Condren has these gorgeous trays. They come in two sizes, the large and the medium. This is the large. It's a really nice size, perfect for entertaining or for just leaving on your coffee table for decoration, for putting coffee table books in, for putting drinks on for a party, for putting cupcakes on, what have you. Uh, and the medium one, which is slightly smaller, retails for $65, and then this large one, $85. And it is so beautifully made. What I love about it is that you can actually purchase separate inserts um, to go in it. So. I bought this one, this is the Paisley one, you can see it has our initial on it, R. Then, I also saw this cute one for the holidays, so for Christmas, it says the Ross family on it, you can have it personalized with the family name. And my absolute favorite is the Life in Little Squares where you put, um, you design this on their website with your own photos. You can do one that's just one big photo or one that's these little kind of Instagram size photos. I did this, I designed this using our, um, some photos from our baby moon in Hawaii. In fact, we even had the back personalized to reflect that. Um, and I just think this is such a nice thoughtful gift for parents or for friends. I have given these in the past. Um, they actually haven't had them the interchangeable um, insert option is newer. Um, so I just think that's a really nice thing because you can actually go buy more inserts if you receive this as a gift or if you get one for yourself. Um, you can get different inserts for every holiday. I just think it's a really nice thing and really, really versatile, useful house gift. I usually include something to do with hot chocolate in one of my gift guides every year because you guys know I just think that's a fun festive thing to share at the holiday season. And last year I shared this little hot chocolate like stovetop pot which I still use and love because um, I was bummed that the electronic hot chocolate maker that I had been using was unavailable. Well Breville has released a new one. It's the hot chalk and froth. Um, this is the box that it comes in but this is what it looks like in actuality. And it's this cute little electric pot, you plug it in um, and it makes a cup of hot chocolate in literally two minutes. Like, heats the milk from ice cold to hot, melts the chocolate, it's got an aerator built right in. Um, I'll try to show you. Um, so it froths as well. Now to be honest, it's not a huge capacity. To make a really nice cup of hot chocolate, it makes anywhere between six and eight ounces at a time, which is actually a very small amount in this day of supersized mugs and things. Um, so I usually make two, 
two pots for one like mug um, to fill one big mug but if you're a person who really loves hot chocolate wants to have a little treat every day but wants to kind of control how much hot chocolate you're having this is nice because if you just do it once it's like six to eight ounces 99.95 really nice price for a really nice quality machine it works really well as far as I mean I've only tested it a few times but as far as I can tell it works really well and I think if you wanted to bundle this that would be nice. William Sonoma makes some of my favorite hot chocolate and hot chocolate accessories. I really love their chocolate flakes. Um, this is the salted caramel. They also have peppermint. They have a gingerbread one this year, and then they have the classic chocolate. It's really nice. They're actual like shavings of chocolate. Beautiful, beautiful hot chocolate comes from making this with milk. Um, and then these these cute little snowman marshmallows. I just think this bundled together. You know, even as a smaller gift or then with the hot chocolate maker as a bigger gift, it's a really nice, you know, kind of all-encompassing hot chocolate care package of love. Lastly, I wanted to include a food subscription item because this is something that we like to exchange with our friends as subscription services. Um, so the give the gift of last year we gave coffee, um, like a monthly coffee subscription. Uh, from Craft Coffee, which is wonderful. I highly recommend it. I also gave that to my husband and he has so enjoyed it this year. Um, so this year I wanted to do something a little different, so I went poking around and I heard wonderfully great things about Jenny's ice cream, which just happens to have a pint club, a yearly pint club. And what it is, it's a quarterly subscription where every three months you get three pints of ice cream. I think one of their traditional flavors, a limited edition flavor, and then like a seasonal flavor. Um, Jenny's ice cream is very, very well known in the Midwest. I don't know if it's nationwide known, but they do ship nationwide. And what a fun gift to give to somebody who loves ice cream or a family who loves a little treat now and then. It's not an overwhelming amount of ice cream. Three pints every three months isn't going to like, you know, feel like overkill, but it's just a really, really nice, sweet, literally sweet gift. It's $144 and I just think it's so much fun. What a fun food subscription gift. And that is everything. That concludes my extravagant splurges picks for this year. I'd love to hear what some of your um, picks or wish list items in this price category are if you care to share. I did mention that I am hosting a little giveaway to go along with this. I'm giving away a few of the things that I shared in the For Her category. If you head on over to my coordinating blog post, you can enter there. Um, the giveaway will run internationally. It'll be open for one week's time. And if you're under the age of 18, I just ask that you have print permission to enter. I will email the winners directly as always. Just wanted to give back a little of the holiday love and cheer to you guys. I have one more gift guide to share this year. Um, next week I will share my stocking stuffers picks and that includes things that are $25 and under and smaller in size, kind of stocking stuffer sized. Um, so stay tuned for that if you're interested and I hope you are all well. Happy holidays to everyone. Thanks for watching guys. Take care. Bye.